Hey, it's time for Tony's Tea, a look at some entertainment headlines that grab my attention today. The last seven days for Chris Brown, it's been kind of rough. The man he had hired to help with his image after the Rihanna thing says that Chris Brown beat him up. Now, Chris Brown says he stole money from him. But did you put hands on the man, Chris Brown? Answer the question. <laughs> the next thing, Suge Knight sues him because he says it's Chris Brown's fault that he got shot a while back. And now his publicist has quit reportedly because he called her the B word. She didn't quit because he called her the B word. That may have been the last straw, though. BET chairwoman and CEO Deborah Lee says she has no idea why D'Angelo wasn't part of the Prince tribute. She says that you have to ask our VP of programming, Stephen Hill, because I thought he was part of it. Now, there's no animosity, she says. Everything's good, and we look forward to having D'Angelo on the program once again. But she has no clue as to what happened. Mm -hmm. And Kelly Rowland went back in the studio yesterday to work on new music. This is what she told Hip Hollywood. She says, I'm being selfish. I lock myself in. Expect some new music by the end of the year. Hopefully in the fall is what she says. At KRB.com, the cast of Love & Hip Hop Atlanta may all be fired. And check the pictures out for Solange's 30th birthday. That's the tea on Smooth R&B 105.7.